What's up guys, Arkad here with a brand new Duel Links video for you guys. It's been a minute since I made a Duel Links video, so today I figured, why not? Let's post some Duel Links, let's talk about why I haven't been uploading Duel Links in a while. Because before, you know, if you're, you know, part of the channel because of Duel Links, I upload Duel Links like once or twice a week. This is a variety gaming channel, so I upload, you know, any game that I feel like uploading without like talking about it. So that includes, you know, console games and, uh, you know, mobile games. And being that I am a huge fan of, of Yu-Gi-Oh, I figured, you know, Duel Links will be a good mobile game to to upload to the channel because it's just Yu-Gi-Oh! And as a big Yu-Gi-Oh! fan, it made sense. So why have I not uploaded Duel Links? Why have there been a huge drought in Duel Links content on this channel? Well, for the most part, I haven't really been dueling a lot. Like, I've been taking part in the, the PvE events that they, that they added to the game. They, I've been taking part in the new um, Dark Side Dimensions uh, that, that they added. But I haven't been du dueling any PvP duels. And that's usually what I upload to the channel. I usually always upload PvE uh, duels. And I haven't been doing PvP duels. Like I, I did just start doing the Casey, Casey Cup tournament, but um, for the most part, I just haven't had the interest. It's not because I'm not good at it. It's not because I don't, you know, like it. I just haven't had the, the drive to, to do PvP duels. And there's a reasons for that. You know, first and foremost, before anyone goes, maybe it's because you're bad at it. Again, when I first started doing the Casey Cup tournament, um, right now, I wanted a 20 game win streak. I'm good at the game. You know, I'm perfectly fine when it comes to dueling. In any meta when it comes to Duel Links. I've been, I've been playing Yu-Gi-Oh! since the card game first came out in America. So I'm, I'm, I'm pretty fine when it comes to, to actually dueling. The thing is, when your meta doesn't change, when your meta stays the same, when your meta isn't you know, engaging, people lose interest. I lost interest in Duel Links because of the meta. The meta has not changed. It's still exactly the same. And you can say that the meta kind of got, got strengthened with the, the, ad, the addition of Dark Side of Dimensions. So, you know, Blue Eyes got, you know, revamped. Blue Eyes got stronger. People still playing, you know, the exact same decks. And, you know, that gets boring. When you're doing the exact same duels every single day for, for months at a time, like a year, you just, like, you know, I, I don't care. I don't want to do these duels when every time I play Duel Links, I'm, I'm playing against Blue Eyes. I'm playing against Ancient Gears. I'm playing against Six Sams. Six Sands are still a thing. I'm playing against Neos, playing against all these. Neos just got nerfed and people are still playing Neos. And you know, it comes to that point where it's like, Konami, you have to, you have to start hitting EX decks harder than you have. You know, because the first time they even touched the EX decks was the, the Neos deck. And that's not even really necessary. You know, them hitting Neos was more so directed towards another deck, not the Neos deck itself. You know, they were more so doing that to nerf the Desperado decks, to nerf the, the, the Neos combination decks, not to nerf um, the heroes themselves. Meanwhile, Blue Eyes is still just strong. It's a deck that literally puts you know, 3,000 light point beaters on, on the field on the first turn. It's a deck that puts a, a card on the field first turn, Blue Eyes Spirit, that banishes the card, banishes a, a back row. And you made it better. Ancient Gears are still literally OTK machines. When, you, when your meta stays the same, when you're not nerfing things, when you're not balancing the community uh, cards, people like me lose interest. So the reason why I haven't been uploading Duel Links to the channel, which I have been uploading um, Top of Yu-Gi-Oh! at all on the channel, is because I just haven't had the interest in doing PvP. Until now, because you know I've been doing the KC, KC Cup. But that's that's the thing, you know. That's what when it comes down to. It, it took the KC Cup happening for me to actually do a PvP duel. I haven't done a PvP duel in two months, and it took the KC Cup for me to actually just start doing PvP duels. That's sad. That's how boring PvP has become. And so I play I play duelings daily, but it's only to do PvE stuff. Even those two months where I wasn't doing PvP duels. I'm still doing PvE stuff, grinding out Dark Side Dimensions. But I just didn't want to, and still don't. Like, I'm only doing the KC Cup because of the gems. Not, doing the KC Cup is more so about gems for me than it is to actually do the KC Cup. It's free gems. So I was like, you know, you have to do something when it comes to balancing the game. I said it before, a long time ago, they need to treat Duel Links the way they treat the TCG when it comes to ban lists. Start actually banning cards. I don't think Konami has banned one card in Duel Links. It's time to start banning cards. It's time to start hitting EX decks hard. That way you can make other EX decks strong. 
If you nerf the Blue Eyes deck, maybe the, now the Dark Magician deck can can can, can get strong. Not Dark not Magician, in like, as in like, you know, the Navigation kind of deck, but the, the new Magician Ritual card. That new deck can now get get going. If you, you know, if you nerf Red Eyes. If you move, if you, if you allow other cards to get out of the meta, new decks can get into the meta. You have all these new boxes, and these boxes are just there just to be there because they're not adding decks that are going to break the meta. You just added support for, for, for uh, Black Wings. I love Black Wings. Huge fan of Black Wings. I, blew, I, I built Black Wings in real life. Huge fan of Black Wings. Black Wings is not going to break the meta. People are going to play it. It's going to have some success, but it's not going to destroy the meta. It's going to like peek in a little bit, get some wins, and then whoever plays the Blackwing deck is going to go back to using Ancient Gears, go back to using Blue Eyes, go back to using Red Eyes, go back to using whatever the meta is. It still has been for over a year. You know, and that, and at some point, free gems is not going to be enough to get people like me playing PvP. But I mean, people like me, I mean people who just want free gems. I want, I just want the gems so I can open more boxes. That's it. You know, I put those gems right back into the game. You get those free gems from doing PvP, and I put them right back into the in, into the game. I don't play PvP in duelings because I'm good at it. I don't play PvP in duelings just for the reason of you know just ranking up. I do it for for, for the free gems. If there's more sense for, for ranking up, maybe I, I would play it for ranking up. But to me, there's not enough sense to rank up. I rank up, but it's not a, it's not it's not the reason for me to do it. Anyways, guys, this, this video, thank you for watching. We all enjoyed it. Leave any thoughts in the comments below. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.